All right, everybody, this is gonna be the first drive with the new center exit exhaust. Well, first drive. I actually drove it about halfway home because I kind of just wanted to enjoy it and experience it for myself. Now, I'm gonna record and uh, let you guys hear it. So we're gonna do a little bit of a start here. It is very, very, very deep. It's a lot deeper than my previous uh, Remark quad tip cat back exhaust with the Burke uh, catless, no resonator, no muffler, nothing uh, mid pipe. Now, the exhaust that I had previously had two resonators right you know, where the exhaust tips were. This exhaust actually has zero resonators, or I'm sorry, excuse me, it has zero mufflers but this one has two resonators. My previous exhaust did not have any resonators at all. It was just fully catless, just two mufflers, and it got kind of tingy at the higher RPMs. This exhaust that I have right now is technically a little bit louder, not much louder, but it is also a lot deeper. Now, the funny thing about this is, this exhaust sounds very similar very very similar to my Tomei exhaust Oop, I'm already I didn't stall all the way home and then I stall while I'm trying to make this video this exhaust sounds very similar to my Tomei exhaust that I had a while back now I'm gonna tell you guys right now this cat back the drone honestly is not bad at all. It's a lot less than what I had previously. And the nice thing about it is this catback is really only incredibly loud when you guys are under load. So I'm gonna kind of pick this up when we kind of get some um, open road. system that I had um, they had no resonators so it got incredibly drony and honestly you didn't really want to be in six gear that much in the car you didn't really want to be driving the car all right so recording you didn't really want to be driving the car um, if you were not either just driving very very slow or under load to where you would just hear the turbo and you know you get all that you know good sensation but this one it's not bad like if you're just driving regularly it's almost like it's a little bit louder than stock um, but once you get under load that's when it really opens up and I think that's you know what majority of us want when we choose a cat bag I'm going to show you guys the exhaust what it actually looks like and the welds which are very very nice when I get to my little spot that I always go to but guys want to do this little POV drive to let you guys know exactly what it sounds like I'm really happy I was very very skeptical because I didn't think I would like the way it would turn out as far as the shape which honestly perfect the fitment is immaculate it is perfect and honestly I like the sound because it opens up when I want it to be opened up and it's not loud um, when I don't want it to be loud, which is very, very good. I think that's the perfect balance when trying to choose a cat back. Obviously, 
obviously some people have different opinions they want you know the exhaust loud all the time or quiet all the time but I, I want it loud when I want it to be loud and relatively quiet or quieter when I don't want it to be all right I'm gonna stop talking exhaust footage though I might go pro probably capped Triple A's, you can put these tires to work. When they get warmed up, Jesus. All right, as you guys can see here, this is what the cat back does look like. Honestly, I'm very, very happy with the way this came out. I'm trying to get you guys kind of everything. You guys can kind of see here that it's already kind of it's already kind of burning the, the top of my bumper, which honestly, I don't really give a shit about because you guys can see here, look what happened when I had on the V-Mark quad tip. It literally torched this part of the bumper. I don't think you guys can really see that below on camera, but it literally torched it. So I kind of want to have a different exhaust, you know, something a little bit fun, something a little bit new. But you guys can see at the top here, uh, I hope you guys can see it really well through the GoPro quality. Um, it literally is kind of like already the heat from the cat back from literally shooting flames because i'm already shooting flames it's kind of burning and giving this kind of black part the burnt titanium effect which i think is honestly kind of cool and you know something that's unique about this cat back i'm gonna show you guys underneath here right here um it's very very nice it is a full three inch design so literally from the um front pipe or um, excuse me the over pipe back um it is literally three inch so previously i had a very restrictive exhauster honestly i didn't think it, i didn't even know it was that restrictive the car feels so much better with this cat back and honestly it's it's insane you guys kind of see here too as well the burning that the previous cat back the remark quad tip did uh do so i mean it is what it is the welds are really nice um under the car it doesn't sit too low you guys can see this hopefully you guys can see this pretty well you guys can kind of see the welds here i don't really want to touch it too much but 
how the tip had to be kind of welded and pieced together. Very, very good job. I'm really, really happy about it. And all this is gonna kind of burn. That's why, you know, some of the, the coloration and the technically discoloration of the tip is gonna be changing over time because it is a titanium tip. So as it gets heated up, it burns, it's gonna change color, which honestly, I think it's pretty cool.